Hi everyone. Well, the little lassie was in hospital the other day and she was getting a couple of teeth out. Um, and bless her, then she did all right, but the nurses that looked after her were absolutely spot on. So they were having a little discussion about borrowing each other's pens and having a joke about stealing other people's pens. So I thought, well, I'll tell you what. They've been so good to my little kid. I'm going to make them a couple of pens and I'm going to get the little laser out and put the name on. And these ones I'm going to do out of uh, bamboo, which comes out really nice. And it's going to be slimline kit, but with a fat middle. And what I'm going to use are these as well. It's like a centre center ring. They're just washers. But I think they've got a six point something mil diameter centre. Now, I bought them because they've got the same diameter as the kits that you use was it six point ten is the man is the maybe six let me just check before I talk rubbish as usual let's have a look at this what are they right so they are six point three alright now why is that significant that's significant because You know the bit that pushes the refill in and out? Well, they fit lovely over that. And you know, like there's a brass tube that gets put into there, and they form a lovely little centre band. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue that to one half of the blanks so i'm going to turn them down get the ends nice and flush and then i'm going to glue that to there put them put them up together and turn them with that center band and that center band is going to be flush with the wood so they're not going to be super fat in the middle but they're certainly going to be fatter than the horrendous slimline bushes right because i can't stand slim lines from the thin nearly as much as not standing you know when you get slim lines and people make people make this so you've got your nibby your slim line and they'll do a fat slim line middle and then fat there's the clip like that centre band, fat pen, fat pen, slimline, nib, and this. I mean, that looks like an old, like, you know what women used to wear and drag their waist in? What the hell are they called? Corset. Just, just, no. Right. So... I'm going to drill these out and then we'll get the laser out and put the names on and then we'll see how you finish them. So let's drill these out and move the camera.
BBC News at 11 o'clock. Theresa May is urging the EU to follow Britain's lead and evolve its position to secure the Brexit. Prime Minister has been presented by
as the Russian laundromat. Although the investigation found that the chief executive, Thomas Morgan, had not breached his legal obligations, he has decided to resign. It's been revealed that a wealthy couple from Pakistan have bought millions of pounds worth of property in the UK, despite being part of an inquiry. Sure, the markets, but not so big that it wouldn't get through Congress. Sorkin is again. For much of the last 50 years, economists have tended to think of global financial markets as a giant mechanism that discovers the truth, the true price of assets, the true balance of risk and rewards, and therefore the most efficient allocation of cash.